Every day in the USA, people find themselves in court. Okay, Don, you have Desmond Harper? No, uh, Jimmy Tatum. We're yes, going to take him. Huh? Yeah, Mr. Harper. So come on up. All right. One. I've got four, five, five. There's a motion to revoke probation in 23-413-43. That's uh, probation that you have for aggravated assault family violence. Then we also have probation, motion to revoke probation in 23-CR-580, which is illegal possession of controlled substance. Let me ask you about this file. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. That's not based on that. I didn't print it out. I apologize, sir. I didn't check the new ones. Okay. All three. Yeah. What, what, what am I supposed to know? These, I'll print these them are brand new indictments, it looks like. Right. Yeah, I took them off the other desk and I didn't look inside. I was busy thinking. Okay. Are these. Let me guess. Felon in possession, aggravated assault, and an aggravated assault. Is that what they That's correct, Your Honor. The evading arrest or detention. Mm -hmm. What happened on that? Where'd that go? It's still, I believe that's the misdemeanor. It's that, still that pending. Yes. Misdemeanor court? Yes. All right. Okay, go ahead. Uh, and you are Desmond LeRae Harper. Speak out, please, yes. sir. Yes, sir. I, go I, ahead. I file a motion to withdraw as his attorney on these cases. Why is that? We've had a lot of difficulty communicating with each other. Uh, he has actually uh, made a threat to me, uh, and I feel like that it's impossible for me to communicate. You threatened yeah. one of my attorneys here? Threatened me. First or not, he threatened you cursed him out? Yeah, I did. He's, why'd you, why would you do Good. such a thing? So? I wouldn't feel incarcerated. The same, the same charge, the same victim, and I got stabbed. What did, why did you curse at him? He came up here and didn't even know what, what, what I was charged. It's offered me 20 years. Well, no, he didn't offer you the pro I was on probation for, for a charge. The victim said on the federal government, he'll keep phone there. They only press charges on me just to get victim assistance. Boy, then I was I was charged and went to jail, was stabbed up, and came to jail for that same person. Y'all never did nothing. How you think I'm feeling? I got pulled over. For Wait a second. The head, like, you you telling me my... I didn't do anything? You said y'all didn't me, do you anything. Gave me Ten years probation. You ain't looking to my charge. In my cases are nothing. All right. All right. You don't care about me or nothing. All you right. don't care about the law. Well, you're trying to give me 20 years. I what? I the property he came off of me. Whatever they are, 20 years. That's my life. All right. Y'all ain't even looking into the charge. Here's what we're gonna do. Cases. Here's what we're gonna do. Uh if you get upset and you get violent, we will bind you. I ain't gonna you know, you're an angry I'm person. I'm not you're angry, angry. I'm you're interrupting me. Whatever, and you're rude. I am. You are rude. So people, that's unlawful. You, you think uh, you're, you're rude? You're something. going to follow the law. Yeah. You're going to follow the rules while in my court, or we will bind you and and we will mute you. And you're going to, if you want to follow the rules and be uh, polite, you will be 
heard. I've got a reason. Now, this man, sick. here's the problem. He can threaten everybody all day long. And I never threaten and nobody. You interrupted me again. Defending you can't even defending, follow the rules. Himself. You can't follow. He just we, buys it out. I, sir, I never threatened in himself. first grade, we, we learned not to interrupt people. First grade, we, we learned the law. Right. law here's the right. He can He can threaten the next person, the next person, the next person. And then we'll be here for 30 years changing out people. I understand. Um, I don't ask for this very often, but in this case, I think you're seeing a small sample. Well, so the other person's going to have to deal with the same. I, I don't know. Uh, yeah, you, you, I said, what y'all have to be talking about with y'all down here. I, I, I can't do it. I'm not a right with judge. I'm not right with district attorneys. Not you know right what? Lawyer you can go. Thank you. You're interrupting. Yeah. You are rude, Injustice. abusive. You don't follow the rules. Whatever. And that's why and you are in custody, you know. sir. All right. I will release you. Well, I find good cause to release you. And uh, the next person on the, uh, on the list will be uh, put. But uh, somebody's got to deal with this problem, and it's going to have to be somebody. And uh, he can be abusive to everybody, and we'll be here for 50 years. But that's not the way it's going to happen. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, and on the record, uh, Mr. Harper is uh, abusive, argumentative, disruptive, and uh, it will be noted for the next person who was appointed to represent him uh, that he is uh, an angry person, but he also has five criminal cases. And the grand jury uh, doesn't know him, and there's no reason to suggest that the grand jury indicted him for zero reason. They had probable cause in aggravated assault, illegal possession of a firearm, aggravated assault, aggravated assault, three aggravated assaults, and illegal possession of a controlled substance. So, for it. Four aggravated assaults and a possession of a firearm. So, uh, and this is just angry at everybody else, but uh, he's here because of what the grand jury deemed were his actions, not yours or anybody else's. All right, uh, we'll have to note. Uh, that Tommy next time he comes in. Yes.